We're here at the tower. We're setting up in advance of our uh, Sense of Grenada Vetiver Workshop, Distillation Workshop. This uh, Mr. Augustine Alexis here setting the still up and running it with me. So we have a 10 liter uh, Lembic Copper still, a columnar still. And uh, it's all set up and good to go. Our water is boiling out here. Coming up, a vetiver is in the column right here in this area and it comes up through the head out and this is our condenser we are constantly circulating a big barrel of nice cold water through this pot uh, so the condenser coil gets cooled off and the steam turns into liquid and that liquid is a mixture of hydrosol and essential oil and it's plot, it's going straight into an essencier. And what the essencier does is it uses the, um, a natural phenomena that, um, uh, it's most essential oils weigh less than water. So they float to the top. And this little screw here goes all the way to the bottom and we can unscrew it and screw it to set the height of relatively where it's pulling from, whether the very, we unscrew it tall and the bottom of the screw is up at the top of this column and it's pulling essential oil. Or right now we're just starting to, we're really just trying to achieve hydrosol right now. So in its low position, it's just getting the water from the bottom of the essentia and automatically dripping into just our little nice clean jar to, um, to store and use the hydrosol for uh, linen spray here at the tower. And we have another still ready to go to give hands on, break it down, set it up and how the still works. And then of course it's perfume, perfume, perfume. So we're gonna reference some very traditional 19th century perfumery techniques that ex kind of explain this process as well. We'll look at a couple of per commercial perfumes we have a fantastic sponsorship of St. Vetiver Perfume by Dia Sundurga. Some lovely samples to give out. Euphorium Brooklyn, Usar, and you know Usar is the word for vetiver in, in the Indonesian Sunda language. A really beautiful book about uh, vetiver from farm to bottle from LMR and Nez or Ne Perfumery. Uh, sorry, a publishing company. And... Uh, that's only a part of it over here in the big tent we're going to be having a setup of uh vetiver handicraft and weaving the grasses and all the soap making and candle scenting you can do with the glorious vetiver we're going to be burning braziers of vetiver to just infuse the wonderful gardens and uh this is what it looks like before everybody gets here cheers <laughs>